everyone just wanted to do a quick video on Bricks remote templates. So this is a feature that Bricks has that lets you share templates from other websites and put them on websites that you own or that your clients own. So let's take a look at what that looks like. Uh, this is a just a temporary website I have here installed with just a basic layout that I made with Bricks. And uh, if we come in here to the dashboard, you want to come to the Bricks tab here and you want to come to settings. And then you want to come here to the template tab. So hit templates. And so this first section allows you to make this website into uh, a template site where other people can use this, the content on this site on other websites. But we want to look at remote templates, which lets you use uh, design sets from other websites on your own website. So right here we have this typed in, Bricks Design Set. We come in here, we have the Bricks Design Set website. Uh, this is a free design set that all you have to do is type in this URL uh, right here into the remote templates URL and hit save and then you have access to all of these templates here. So if we come in here to there's a blog category, there's a contact page, a footer, hero section, slider, various things that you can choose from. So there's pricing tables and there's another pricing table and another one so these are all ones that you can then use on your website so if we come back to our website here we take a look at our page here let's go to the edit the home page and you can see i have already laid out a couple sections here uh, these are ones that i just made quickly with bricks very easy to use so far it's i'm a bit of a big fan of bricks um, so to, to use these templates, you need to come up here to the template tab right here, click that. And the first time you load these in, they might not show up. So first of all, these are templates on the current website. So all I have is a header on this temporary website. That's why it's showing up here. But let's say you wanted to turn one of your pages into a template. You can do that here. And if you click up here at remote templates, uh, you might not see these right away, so you want to come in here. Once you've saved that URL, you want to hit refresh here, and it should bring up all those templates from that website. And also, if you hover here, I just want to show it does show the website right up there, bricksdesignset.com. So that's useful for knowing what site you're bringing templates in from. And great, so let's let's start inserting a template, and it will ask you this template contains a theme style. Sometimes you might want to do that if you're starting fresh, or maybe you have a theme style already, which I do, so I'm going to hit no. And just like that, I've got my all my new icon boxes, my card, and I've got three cards, and it has the image, and it has the div wrapper, and it has the meta description, the title, the text below it, so everything's nicely ordered and named, which I like. And let's look at it on other devices. So. There it is on a, a tablet portrait view, global landscape. They turn into stackable cards rather than rows. And again, on desktop, great. That looks good already. There's some built-in padding there. So everything's gonna look good regardless of the screen size. So I like that it's already responsive right out of the gate. That's awesome. Um, let's come by here, let's add another section. Come down here to the section and we'll hit templates and we'll start adding more the remote templates and let's add content six i'm going to forego the import of the theme style and wonderful just like that i've got my text ready to go with our h2 for our services image i can change out right now it's using pexels which is a free image site uh, check it out if you haven't and uh great so let's take a look that's what it is on portrait so everything is fully responsive right out of the gate which is can save you a ton of time when designing stuff so i uh, just want to give a shout out to uh, the creator of this site bricks design set i believe his name is danny something or other danny coster if we check this oh yeah here's the author uh, danny or danny coster great job hopefully i didn't butcher your name and uh so yeah this is this is essentially all i wanted to show you it's a great, great resource to start with, especially you can see, um, you know, you can import stuff and then see how uh, this author has constructed these websites. I mean, you see 
there's padding, uh, you know, various padding between stuff. So it, they've taken the time to really make sure that this looks good right out of the box on any screen. Um, so anyway, yeah, that's that's the remote templates. So just to review it, uh, we come back here to bricks. We come to our settings and we come to templates. So it can be confusing because there's templates here. This template tab is for creating templates on your own website. This is for managing how those templates are used, whether you allow other people to use them with this part, and you, you know, you, you check, check off uh, what, my template access, just like that. And this is for allowing you to access other people's design sets on your website. So type the URL in there and save it. Make sure to hit save, of course. And then you just edit with bricks. Come in here to templates, remote templates, hit refresh if you're not seeing them, and then start adding. It's as simple as that. So um, just add that in there. Great, so there we've got our template. I can come in here, change out my image, change my text, just like that. Change my description. So everything uh, it looks good. And again, looks good on uh, your devices. And stacking nicely. So that's, uh, that's how it is for remote templates. Uh, any questions, let me know. And then don't forget to like and subscribe. Thanks, guys.